Hello, Cancer, and welcome into Sage Sunset Healing Tarot. And I do hope you are well, my darling. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you for liking the video, for sharing it with those you love and or those you don't love, and for hitting the subscribe button. All of our support is abundantly appreciated, and I'm truly, truly grateful. All right, so thank you, and do continue to come around. Come around. Come around, Cancer what's missing what's the moon card what is this moon energy for can say you can say i feel like doing an inspired reading for you today Ooh, let's talk about the money all right these are general tarot card readings cancer so do take the ones the messages that apply and the rest let them fly <laughs> tell me some money 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 all right so we see a lot you're in here cancer by a sign we see a house oh my god i love this i love that these three cards just popped out something is going to make you extremely happy we have the three of hearts here so it's like a joyous celebration bubbling up maybe celebrating with others about something new that is springing forth for you my darling it's happening really quickly too it's like mm, let me see if i can get this energy for you It's like a sudden turn of events. You know, it's that energy if something wasn't flowing efficiently. And then um, something new come in and it starts picking up speed like a new team, new contractors. But because someone is building, you know, maybe someone is getting married or looking to get married. And then something was on hold or, you know, some sort of a delay took place with the moon energy, something like that. Or right, just maybe things weren't flowing. I'm getting the energy of someone starting a business. Oh, yes. With the Ace of Wands. This is a new business, a new idea. Okay. Or a new spiritual um, venture. Really awakening your, your spiritual gifts, your intuition, connecting to your ancestors, your roots. Really taking hold of who you are. Maybe you were really on this soul-searching journey. And then all of a sudden, you're wondering, where am I? What am I doing? So you weren't seeing the progress with the Knights of Wands energy moving toward this dream that you're chasing. Something that you really want to align with and it's meant for you, Cancer. This is the 2 at 2, 11, 11. This is a divine union. Whatever it is that you're working on, it's meant to really come together for you. Okay? I feel like you're going, you're getting there. You see this, all right? Um, so it's that energy of the progress not moving as quickly as possible or you know i'm saying like someone planning a wedding oh yes it's that energy and then there's or planning a big event and there's delays and the flower company there's problem there and there's problem here and here and there and it's just like someone threw the papers in the air like oh my god this is too much kind of a breakdown but then it's the reviving of that like someone went away like gathered themselves and kicked it back into gear with the knight of wands energy and is ready to go and got new ideas and new inspiration just ready to go again to chase this dream like never ever you're like and look how quickly you are running toward this hmm? and you see how how quickly you came out in this message cancer you're ready for this message you know I really appreciate you being here. So if the message just resonates with you, go ahead, hit the like button for me. And if you find the messages inspiring, do share it with those you love, you know. And if you haven't yet, do subscribe to the channel. Okay, Cancer. I really like this. It's like a confirmation. It's like something you wanted to know. Look, so the Three of Cups is happiness. It's celebration. It's like, yes, something ended and you're happy like graduation time or um the end of a court case and you are successful or something that at the end you can celebrate or for some people it's really the beginning of something brand new and beautiful that is allowing you to really just be uh just be a dream chaser you know what i mean like um what is that pursuing your your dreams here it's so beautiful see like you're in pursuit of a, a grand goal i feel something that you have hoped for you may have um as if you may have retired from another position to chase this dream or something like that look it's like it's so beautiful i love it it's like niche lane these cards are beautiful like i'm stunned that it came out like this 
you took this baton and you are taking it to the finish line. I may be reading for a cancer that is cuspy with the Leonian vibration here, fire energy. Or you may just have a lot of fire passion in your chart or experiencing this passion right now in your energy. Yeah, I do feel like your energy has picked up speed. Um, you know, that's the vibration as if you were feeling a bit down before, but you're getting on top of this. It may be because of this full moon vibration that we're experiencing. Hey, guys, have you been seeing this full moon? It's so beautiful. Um, it's this full moon. It's awakening uh, maybe your old desires. You know what I mean? It's like um, like your water has been stirred or something like maybe You know, it's this vision that you have, the King of Cups, King of Pentacles. And there was this feeling of not knowing how to get to this vision of a complete wealth and abundance that you want to experience and live and be in. Whatever that means for you. And I know um, it's well-being internally is important. Okay, so I feel like Cancer, you're also learning how to master your emotions as the King of Cups vibration is a master of energy here. Emotions on this water, the motion, the movement guiding you to where you need to go and then you came up on this place like all right i'm in control of my emotions i'm eating well i'm sleeping i'm meditating what do i need to do next that's the energy of like this this pause in progress with the moon vibration all right but you're you're seeing it's almost like it's already done but it's just you getting there you know, or figuring out how to really get through to this place that you've visualized and manifested already. But what, what's getting you there is you finding a dream, a passion, an idea, an intuition, your gift or something that's allowing you to chase this. And I like, it's like you're chasing it in the moonlight. It's beautiful. It's like um, I'm seeing you right across the, a mountain top in the distance with the moon in the background like you're, even at night you're chasing your dream it's like you're riding across the moon like you're jumping over the moon the cow jumps over the moon it's like you're making the impossible happen or is it that you're thinking outside of the box or you're breaking barriers cancer jumping over the moon that's the energy i'm feeling like you're jumping over the moon it's almost like excitement and i hear glee as well to get to where you need to be jumping over the moon over the hurdles over the lack of clarity that you sometimes feel and I, you're so powerful i like the energy that you're embodying like this strong visualization that you're you're into this strong focus now and, and you're working on your emotions a lot of things are going to come to light i don't feel like clarifying any of these cards if you feel like you need a clarify play a clarifier for any one of these cards out here do let me know we have the tower energy like an ending a clarity oh like this is what happened with the moon the moonlight is not secrets in this one the moonlight is lighting your way through the night or through the ending or through the dark times it's like you're riding through a city at night and the moonlight is really helping you a broken city or you're leaving the uh, you're leaving the rubble behind you're tra you're finding your way out but the moonlight is here to help you it's not here to guide to to um it's not here to to hold you back it's not a secret in this reading you know look the intuition the high priestess it's more of a it's more of a light bringer this moon because you're moving through the night maybe through the dark night of the soul through the night of wands you're the night you're chasing your dreams it's, it's almost like you're rising up let me get this for you it's like this city that was broken down a long time ago a lost city i don't know why you need to go through here like you need to go through this dark place like that you need to go through the energy you had to travel through here to get to where you're going you know what i mean because i'm seeing this city in the desert literally i'm feeling like egypt and i'm feeling a lot of sand and this broken down city like a long time ago in egypt that was made of clay bricks and there there's rubble but then this person is just riding through the city and there's anyone there it's just a dilapidated city and I'm seeing this person, I'm looking at this person from the distance up on this hill, riding across the mountaintop 
with the moonlight just guiding their way. And I know that this person is on a mission. I can feel it like I'm witnessing this person move across this desert strip. And I know that they're heading somewhere like this is the one that's also chasing the North Star kind of vibration to your vision, your dream destination. So you had to pass through this city as if I had to see you too. I had to witness you go through here. Like you, through this ending, whatever you went through, Cancer, you're picking it up and you're moving through. You're on this mission. I like it. It's like a movie. See, something happened. Maybe you were broken down, a delay, a sabotage. But now it's so beautiful. All right. So any mess, any one of the cards, we have the Ace of Wands, the Knight of Wands, the Four of Wands, the King of Cups, the Moon, the King of Pentacles. Which do you want clarified? Cancer, you're so beautiful and so happy. You're... Um, your features, your facial features are really like distinctively beautiful. Okay. Fire on passion. Solving. Maybe you're trying to solve something. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like a trailblazer. You're solving something. What are you solving? The Michelin, the mission. What is this? What is cancer solving here? What is cancer solving a business idea or something solving it so why are you solving it what is the queen of wands the wheel of fortune the knight of cups let me tell you the knight of cups has been here since the beginning of this reading but we just didn't talk about this one there's a lot of fortune coming in for you a lot I don't, there's a, there's a water sign bringing this in a fellow water sign, Cancer Pisces, Scorpio, or this is you yourself. Someone is moving toward you too. What is that energy, please? It's like, uh, it's like they're a stream, a partition. I can't feel it. It's two different energies, as you can tell. Fire sign, water sign. One is in a hurry and one is just gently taking their time. I'm not sure if you two are meeting or if you are the same as the Knight of Cups energy here as you change. But it's like a different vibration now. But this Knight of Cups is bringing in this fortune within this liquid cup. This Knight of Cups is very confident and clear and pure and innocent and pristine and beautiful and loyal and jovial and very intentional, very spiritual, hey, respectful, I like this. Mm. I like the person that this is. You know, it's that energy of a knight that even his horse works with him. You know, that energy of that knight in shining armor that he goes... Or he has, he talks with his horse. His horse has his personality, something like that. Um, okay. Mm -hmm. I'm seeing fishes here too. This person could be Pisces, a winged angel, an angel of delight. Delight. Now, as I say delight, I feel like this person might come into you. Now I'm getting the energy is very much softer. Delight. Because I feel when you hear the word delight, it takes your, it, it grabs your attention. Why delight? Cancer, when you hear the word delight, you're like, ooh. <laughs> it kind of slows you down. Like you're like, oh my God, there's something delightful. And so that makes you now want to, you're, you can, you're like slowing down your energy so that you can feel this person's smooth cool rush like as it enters into your life really you know what i mean because they're coming with a smooth because if you were burning and anxious and all these things so maybe you should um like if you're in a delightful mood cancer it's almost like oh it's like twink like twink i'm getting the energy of a fairy um you know the energy of a fairy i like you cancer whosoever you are that i'm talking to right now a very fun spirit. You could be connected to lizards, some way, shape, or form, reptilian, cold-blooded, but not really. Maybe calculative, or you're good with hearing, or adaptability, 
or you feel protected by lizards or something about the lizards around you oh it's really connected the deserts and the lizards are connected to you it makes me feel like you were once very important I'm getting another energy of a movie. You're once you're so brave, you know, with this Knight of Pentacles, Knight of Wands energy. It's very brave. You're brave, very brave, very very brave, courageous. You don't mind doing it alone and happily too. Um, I do feel like as like this love that's coming into you. As I say, you're on your journey. But if you stop to hear like the word delight, maybe that means something delight. And um, I'm going to end this reading. There is noise. So thank you for listening. But this, I feel like this person is bringing in like, it's so beautiful, like a caravan full of fresh water. And just, it's a delightful things. It's very delightful what they bring. But it's like cool water. It's like cool water. It's like this person's energy. It's going to like ooh you. Like it's the first time you're seeing this. It's like you're a mermaid and you're on land and you're learning different things. And then this person shows you a spoon and you're like ooh. Like I don't know. They're showing you many different things. The Wheel of Fortune. This is a lot. I just. Show me what the Wheel of Fortune is. Show me at least a little bit. What's the Wheel of Fortune please? <laughs> The Queen of Pentacles and the Queen of Cups. <laughs> All right, this is so beautiful. I do feel soulmate vibration here. Like you will realize this. All right, this person may be coming toward you. That's what I'm saying. Cause see now you've cooled down a bit <clears throat> with the Queen of Cups to receive. To feel, to know that this person is just like you have the energy. You have to. You like you know they're coming in. Anyway, <clears throat> gonna go. Thank you for being here, Cancer. I hope the message is resonates with you and is able to help you on your journey. All right, all right. Take it easy out there. Cycles ending, taking a leap of faith, closing chapters, moving forward, standing in your power. All right, the death energy, like a whole transformation taking place, bubbling. Remember that all is within you. Take care. Bye. CMOS heals the body by removing harmful chemicals that are caused by some foods we eat, hormones, toxic substances, and radiation from 5G from our devices. Heal your temple with the minerals of infinite oceans. CMOS has over 90 of the 102 nutrients our body needs, like copper, which creates balance and harmony. To learn more about CMOS health benefits or to order your first premium grade CMOS, email italkitchenstyle at gmail.com.